Russia and all the rest of them wants theirs, and the different scientists wants to make themselves a great name. Each nation wants to get its brainy man. We want ours. We want the educational system in it. We want a denominationalism. That's just exactly what we got. That's what you did. That's what you wanted. That's what God gave you. Now, what are you going to do with it if you got it? We're talking about Russia for another minute. The Russians are calling for a man who can conquer space. They're trained them as fast as they can. They're scientists. What if they get one? What if they get their Messiah? What's we going to do? The mercy on us if they get it. Remember, Germany just got such a Messiah not, long time, not very long ago, a Hitler. We know what it done to them. Now, what about the church? What kind of a Messiah is the church looking for today? You, the church has cried the loudest. <laughs> so what are we hollering about a Messiah? What are we hollering about? Revival in our time. Back this, that, the other. What are they looking for to do it? What more do you want? What does the church want? Anyhow, we've already got it. God gave it to us. It's his promise for this hour. We look in the Bible, we see it every fourth in the Bible. Uh, anointed ones come on and made that word live again. Right in the hour, for that hour. And we've got the Messiah. This is him. The Word. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, and the Word remains God. Amen. Hebrews 13, 8, the same yesterday, today, and forever. We know what's supposed to take place in this day. We're wanting a Messiah. And God gave us a Messiah, His promised Word for this day. It's just waiting for somebody with faith to anoint it. Make it live again. Yes, sir. It's a real Messiah. It's the Word of God. Which Jesus said, both heavens and earth will pass away, but my word shall never pass away. But the church sets spiritually dead.